And on Saturday, May 4th, Dragon Boat Racing will take place on Lake Bulow in Pineville. Davion Telsey is here with me in the studio and has more on the Dragon Boat Race. Davion? Yeah, Johnny. The 12th annual Dragon Boat Racing is scheduled to take place this Saturday as local businesses, churches, and community members gear up for the race. In the Dragon Boat Race, each team consists of 16 paddlers and one drummer. It's important to have at least six female paddlers in the boat during the race. You can also have alternate paddlers if needed. Before the race, there are practice sessions in the evening where you will learn how to paddle, race, and stay safe. Each team gets a 10 by 10 tent that, that's spaced along the river. Don't worry, the equipment as paddles, life vests, and boats, drums, and steering equipment will be provided. If you bring your own gear, it needs to meet the race rules. To me, personally, uh, I've been doing, this is my third Dragon Boat races with the museum. Um, and before I worked here, I didn't really know anything about it. But it is really a great exercise in synchronicity um, and teamwork. So the only way that that Dragon Boat moves smoothly and quickly is if everybody is in sync and working together towards a goal. That's why it's always fun to see who wins because it's never guaranteed for anybody. We've had CrossFit gyms win and we've had a church win. So it really depends on how, how you work as a team. And I think that's really great. The day begins with a captain briefing at 8 a.m. ensuring all teams are ready for the race. At 8.30 a.m., the lively opening ceremony and drum parade kicks off the festivities. The event features including the, the Pineville Elementary School drumming line at 12.30 p.m. and includes with the closing award ceremony at 3 p.m. where the participants gather around and honor the day's achievement. Johnny, back to you.